this is a number line question. We already know that N and Q are to the right of M, and this is important information for later on. We're looking for the ratio of QN to MQ, which is the distance from Q to N and from M to Q. Now, if we look at the second statement, it's clearly not sufficient because this doesn't tell us anything about the ratio or number or difference between them. It just tells us that Q is somewhere between M and N, but Q could be really close to M or really close to N. So I don't know given that situation and that's insufficient. We're looking for a hard number out of the ratio. Statement one says two MN equals three times MQ. Well, this doesn't say anything about QN, but can we construct some information here? So in this situation, let's pretend that MN is, is equal to three X. And that means that two times three X is equal to three times something else. And that must be two X over here. So no matter what the X represents, we know that MN is equal to three X when MQ is equal to two X. So the distance from M to N, if we draw this out, is three X. And the distance from M to Q is going to be two thirds of that, it's going to be two X. So the difference between, uh, between Q and N is going to have to be one X. And we know this because we know that they're to the right of M on the, num on the number line. There's no other way to set this up. So we know that the ratio of QN, which is equal to X, to MQ, which is equal to 2X, is a ratio of one to two, and that is sufficient. So statement one on its own is sufficient, and that means answer choice A is our answer.